Hey guys, I'm Lucy with Ross Munster Vans. This is Sam, and today we're going to take you through one of our latest builds. So Sam's going to kick us off with the exterior. Yep, so we got upgraded Toyo Open Country AT tires on this thing, and a Agile rip kit as well. Let's uh, step in here, take a look at this thing. Alright, welcome inside this 2019 Mercedes Sprinter. This is a 170 wheelbase, so as you can see, it's incredibly long. It's a very large vehicle. Um, as far as layout goes, up front we have our dinette as well as a fold-down additional bed. As we move back, we have storage, our kitchen on the passenger side, and then another much larger dinette in the back with a raised bat bed platform that is on an actuator, so this guy's gonna go up and down. We'll start at the front of the van and work our way back, going through each of the different parts of this build. Okay, so at the front of this uh, van, we've got a nice dinette unit, um, doubles as a bed. Um, you got this really sweet lagoon table, swivels, room for two, um, nice place to work or um, uh, sit and hang out for dinner. Um, and then we have these, this pretty sweet system where the backrest folds down and you've got a nice uh, extra bed here. So on the passenger side, we've got our kitchen here, nice walnut countertop. Um, and here is the 15 by 20 Rivati workstation sink. Nice um, gold and black faucet. Um, has a, it's detachable, pretty nice to clean off dishes. Um, underneath the sink, we've got a seven gallon gray water removable tank. Um, back from that is our isotherm one, cruise 130 drawer fridge. Uh, a lot of storage in here, access on both sides. Um, it's even got a little freezer compartment up there on the top. And then back from that, is our Dometic Denatured Alcohol Stove and Oven Combo Unit. So as far as storage in this van goes, there's a ton of space. Um, so starting in the front here, my Vanna White Sam will show you. We have some really <laughs> nice uppers with RV clips so that nothing's going to jangle around as you're driving. Moving a little bit further back, we have basically a full closet here. You yeah. can see around me. Um, on the top and bottom, as well as just additional drawers and or, um, doors here. Another really nice feature of this van is this um, slide out dry flush toilet. So when you need to use it, just slide it out. This uh, slide is rated for somebody to sit on it if they so chose. But another nice thing about these toilets is that you can actually charge them, then take them outside of your van and Find a nice spot in nature, wherever works best for you. Tucks right away. <laughs> also, some kind of special features to this van. Right here, we've got this nice iPad mount. So, if you're sitting at the bench here, you can uh, have your iPad mount mounted and watching TV, what have you. Um, further down here, along this nice towel work, is a spice rack so it's got four canisters to hold you know all different different kinds of spices and then favorite over here is a fruit hammock um, for you know all your fruit needs all right let me take you through the uh, power system in this van here we have our dimmable dome lights so these are all going to be led and then we have our again dimmable upper cab lighting um, just switch to light up the whole switch panel, fridge, water pump, and then Victron Bluetooth energy monitor. Uh, and then lastly, we just have that Rixon system that this is going to control our cabin heat as well as our hot water. So we have the thermostat here as well as all of the controls over here on the left. All right, welcome to the back of the van. Yeah. Back here we have a really nice dinette area for, you can fit God knows how many people. Uh, additionally, this area folds down into a bed to sleep two, maybe three people, and we have this upper deck bed on an actuator. So when these people are ready to go to bed, we lower the actuator and at least two people can sleep up there. A um, couple other cool features in this uh, dinette unit is the lighting. So it's got these four overhead um, dome lights on a dimmer. 
Um, and then in the back, we've got these pretty sweet reading lights that you can shine it on the person over there. And there's also two in the upper deck bed as well. Yeah. Um, additionally, the floor, there, you'll see there's a step up into this dinette unit. Uh, the floor of this pulls out to be another table from the rear of the van. Um, pretty sweet to have like another bar if you want to. Outdoor think. happy hour. Outdoor happy hour, yeah. Also, we've got these two uh, CRL half slider windows. Um, you get really nice cross ventilation in here. Cool, so here's the rear of the van. Open up the doors here, show you the gear slide table uh, floor of this thing. It's kind of all three. So you've got these little tabs, pull this floor table out. It's on 500 pound locking slides, so you can hang out, have a beer. Um, pretty sweet little table, and it doubles as your floor. Other cool things you can find back here, we have our exterior shower hookup, um, and then we have all of our water and all right, so I'm gonna show you guys the water cabinet here. Um, in this van, they've got uh, 20 gallons of water storage here. Um, all the plumbing lines are flex hosing. Um, and as Lucy said, uh, this is the outdoor shower valve box. And here is the handle for it. It's got a quick release. Um, just hook it up here. You got a nice handheld shower. Um, inside, we've got a uh, water pump here on the side and uh, this is this van's equipped with a Rixon system and so that is the uh, coolant reservoir for that Rixon system. Okay so on this side of the van in the back we've got our power cabinet. Uh, this holds our entire power system for this van. Um, in the way back is the inverter. We've got some circuit breakers over there um, and then forward right here is 800 amp hours uh, lithium ion batteries um, pretty beefy for this van and uh, solar on the roof and yeah that's the power system all right thanks for tuning in i'm lucy with ross monster vans and this is sam the designer of this beautiful build and make sure to follow us on facebook instagram all the places nice yeah. job Woo!